This is multiplication strategy three, the hardware boxes. This uses the box layout to multiply two bigger numbers together. You complete those boxes using basic facts and just extending as needed, and then you add it all together. <clears throat> this strategy works best when multiplying two numbers in the tens or hundreds, or two numbers that have got tenths and hundredths in them. <clears throat> in this example, you earn $425 per week, and there are 156 weeks in three years. How much are you going to earn in those three years? So, we need to think, is this 156 times 425, or 425 lots of 156? Is it $425 of 156 weeks, or is it 156 weeks of $425? It is, of course, 156 weeks of $425. So, we lay out our sum, 150 weeks, lots of $425, and we draw out our box strategy. In this case, the both numbers are three digits, so we need three by three. We then break up the numbers using the X strategy that we've used previously. 156 breaks up into 150 and six. 425 breaks up into 420 and five. And then we just do our grid multiplication. Four times one is four, and then we extend by moving the decimal point four places. Four, one, two, three, four. Four times five is 20. And then we extend by three more decimal places. So we move to the right one, two, three decimal places. Four sixes are 24. And we extend by two places. One, two. Next row down, one times two is, of course, two. And we extend by the three decimal places. Five times two is 10. And we extend by two decimal places. And lastly, 6 times 2 is 12, and we extend by the 1 decimal place. Our last uh, row, we have 1 times 5 is, of course, 5. Extend by two zeros. Most of you could have worked out that was 500. 5 fifties, 5 fives are 25, and extend by 1 decimal place. And lastly, 5 sixes are 30. No need to extend. And then probably the hardest part of this is adding it all up at the end. Uh, you can, if you want, hold all the numbers in your head. I like to do it in stages. I find it easier. I do the thousands first. So here we have 40,000. Another 20,000 is 60,000. 62,000. 63,000. 64, 65,000. I'm just going to write that down over here so I remember it. 65,000. Then I add up the hundreds. I start, I've got... Uh, 400 up here, and another 500 makes 900, this 100 makes 1000 or 1000, and this makes 1200, so 1200, so I've got that down as well. And then I add up the 10s, no 10s are really easy, so 20 here, and 50, 20 and 50 is 70, and another 30, so I've got another 100. So no, that's my, my thousands, my hundreds, and my 10 goes up, and then adding up that together is easy. So 66,000, 200 and 100 is 300. So 66,300 dollars is how much you'd earn in three years.